This is what we are going to make today. So good and refreshing. You name it, lemon eclair. Eclair is the most popular patisserie treat in France, thanks to its comforting, easy to eat, and able to be made at home. This recipe, though, is inspired by Cédric Grolet, the world best pastry chef 2018. Hey, I am Bruno Albuzzi. Welcome to the Real Deal Cooking Channel. For the pâte à choux, I'm gonna bring to a boil water, milk, butter, salt, and sugar. So as soon as it boils, a good boiling, I'm going to turn off the heat, add the flour at once, When it's combined, put the heat back on and continue to stir swiftly on high heat for about three minutes until it forms a ball and a film on the bottom of the saucepan. See that? This is what you are looking for. You want to transfer the butter into your mixing bowl and let run on low speed for a couple of minutes and add the beaten eggs and mix on low until well combined. Marvelous. Ah, I love it. Now, and keep this in mind, if you do not use the right tools while baking, you will not succeed. Good news, this non-stick micro perforated silicone baking liner will make your day. This is the only one, by the way, that has two patterns, large and mini éclair. Dust éclair with powdered sugar, and bake for about 40 minutes. Remember that underbaked éclair will collapse. See it for yourself. The great things about this perforated baking mat is that it conducts heat. I would say, mission accomplished. Your turn. Next, the lemon marmalade is going to be the base for our lemon insert. Lemon juice, freshly squeezed, so as soon as the liquid is hot, then I'm going to add my sugar agar-agar mixture. Bring to a boil and cook for a couple of minutes. Cool down on ice water and chill until firm. Meanwhile, I'm going to peel a couple of lemons in order to extract their suprême, a fancy word to say lemon flesh. That's my lemon suprême. You want them to be chopped. And the secret ingredient is finger lime, lemon caviar. In order to remove the seeds, uh, the caviar that it's uh, inside, cut in half and squeeze out caviar with the handle of a wooden spatula. Mix with the lemon supreme and set aside. Next, I'm gonna mince some fresh mint using a sharp knife. Ah, the next thing is my fave, poached lemons. Oh yeah, these are so incredible. Definitely a game changer. To make them, by the way, look up the recipe. I'll give you two options, a low cooking process or the sous vide method. So I am going to combine my poached lemon cubes with my chopped lemon supreme, finger lime, mint, and the lemon mixture. Whoa, now we are talking about serious business. Make a half inch thick slab and freeze. Then divide into bars and keep frozen until ready to use. Next, the yuzu ganache monté. Blend the first half of the hot heavy cream with the melted chocolate. Then I'm gonna add gelatin, remaining chilled heavy cream and the yuzu juice. Blend well and chill overnight. To follow the éclair glaze from scratch, any color, by the way, can be achieved using the same method. Good news is that everything in this recipe can be made days in advance. Heat up milk, heavy cream and corn syrup or glucose. Add the food coloring and whisk in the sugar cornstarch mixture. Bring to a boil and cook to 218 degrees Fahrenheit, 1 hour 3 Celsius. Let cool to 140 Fahrenheit, 60 degrees Celsius. Add the gelatin, blend well, sieve and chill overnight. So next you want to slice off the top of your eclair. You don't have to go all the way through, 
just open them up like that just like a gasket if you wish i mean <laughs> finally eclair assembly whip the yuzu ganache monté to soft picks fill up the body of each eclair then insert a frozen lemon marmalade bar top each lid with more of the filling and close each eclair wipe out any excess mousse and orange eclair onto a baking tray upside down and freeze to harden before glazing. Rewarm glaze to 80 degrees Fahrenheit, 27 degrees Celsius. Glaze the frozen eclair once, freeze again and glaze again. Let thaw in a refrigerator and sprinkle some crystal mint right before serving. I hope guys you have enjoyed this one of a kind lemon eclair episode. To get the full recipe, go to brunoskitchen.net. Please subscribe, like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Pinterest. Bon appétit and see you next time. It's absolutely amazing.